UNSW is officially back on campus after about seven to eight months since uh, UNSW shut its doors um, in about March second week. Uh, so UNSW has started a lot of its uh, activities and facilities uh, from term three um, in terms of offering students face-to-face -face classes and also uh, tutorials. Uh, but there are a lot of rules and restrictions as well still in terms of who should come to campus so what are the precautions they have to take uh, to enter into the campus uh, we'll talk in detail we'll see how the campus is um, but it's it's a relief that uh, now I can at least see some students in the campus back um, in uh, June or July when when there are no students uh, it's literally the, the campus is just dead and um, a lot of students uh, they just use this space for uh, running and walking and then dog walking and all of that stuff but right now it's, it's really good it's, it's, a, it's a really good sight to see uh, students getting back to campus but yeah let's see what's uh, there for us so this is the UNSW bookshop so it's arranged an outdoor selection of books so that there are not a lot of people inside just to make sure that uh, the physical distancing is uh, maintained. I mean still the campus is a lot empty and it's better than nothing. Um, people are telling that there would be about 27,000 students that would be coming for term 3. So February is the biggest intake for the university so I'm hoping that maybe in T1 2021 we can still see a lot of people but it's still a good sign that campus has reopened. Uh, it's reopened a lot of um, facilities like the libraries. All the libraries are open now. Um, so the restaurants on campus and other facilities are still open for uh, students. University is so silent. There's literally no one. So one. I was asking a few cafe owners um, while coming up and I was asking how they are feeling about campus getting into normal and all of that stuff but they are pretty disappointed because they were expecting a lot of people to come back um, to uni but it's not their fault as well uh, but yeah this is the case few cafe owners are still operating even from uh, the lockdown a uh, few cafe owners just started up so we'll see how they, this picks up over the next uh, couple of months and then probably see by the start of February 2021 we should expect a lot of uh, students and uh, coming back to campus